So OpenAI has just silently released ChatGPT agent. Well, it was so silent that even the release video didn't have any sound. So this announcement video you can see is without any sound. Anyway, so ChatGPT now thinks and acts proactively choosing from a toolbox. So this seems more like something like Manus. If you don't know about Manus, Manus was an AI agent which was released a few months ago. So this will be basically a general AI agent that can actually schedule meetings for you, that can actually like plan your trips and like book your trips as well. You can even provide your credit card information as well. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that at this stage, but yeah, you can do that totally. You can also connect it with your Gmail and it can review all of your mails. And similarly, you can connect it with your calendar as well it can also analyze data and then create like powerpoint presentations so all of these features are already that we have in manus so yeah i don't know why i'm trying to compare it with manus but yeah this is what we can expect from gpt apparently it should be available to all of the pro users today so if you're not aware pro subscription actually costs 200 gbs per month i mean i am good i don't want to subscribe to this pro plan to access this chat gpt agent but yeah i mean it will be available for plus users as well in few days so we can definitely wait for a few days to access this cheap copy of Manus. But yeah, I mean, let's see how good it is and how different it is from these existing general AI agents. In terms of benchmarks, there is this benchmark, which is humanity's last exam. And in this ChatGPT agent is competing with deep research with OpenAI O3 and other OpenAI models. Then similarly, it is competing other OpenAI models in Frontier Math as well. So there is this another benchmark which is called DS Bench, which is for data science tasks. And you can see it is competing with O3 Mini in this benchmark. So yeah, if you are a pro user, you can just go ahead and access it right now. And if you are a plus user like myself, you'll have to wait for a few more days. Apparently, this is a very obvious advancement by OpenAI because they are trying to make ChatGPT your main go-to general AI agent. So let's just wait for it to roll out for all of the plus users. And if you have any thoughts about this, you can just share your comments in comment section. I see you next video. Bye-bye.